Hey guys, Metal Viking 82 here, back to show off a little bit of plunder that I've acquired over the last week. Uh, yeah, got a couple CDs to show and a small tape order that I made through Head Split Records. So, just gonna get right into it. First up, got this at Target of all places. It was on sale for $9.99. This is a Metallica SM2. Uh, yeah, I really kind of gotten back into Metallica within the last year and I uh, heard a few songs off of this played on Sirius XM and I just really enjoyed it so decided to pick this up haven't even opened it yet but I'm really looking forward to listening to the rest of it I was hoping they had the Blu-ray available at the same time but they just had the CD so that'll work for now and then uh, this next one I've been after for quite a while now and uh, finally found a copy this is Comic Con with Mega Trends and Brutality. Uh, just old school Swedish death metal featuring LG Petrov on vocals. So, yeah, really happy to find this. The original pressing of this is hard to find for a decent price, but uh, this is a reissue from last year put out by Vic Records. So, really happy to find that. And then on to the stuff from uh, Head Split Records, which I finally got my very first shirt from Head Split Records, and I am wearing it now. This is this awesome molder shirt. Uh, they had this one available and uh, the artwork for the new album, but I went with this one here. And I picked up four tapes. The first one is one that many people have told me over the years is a speed metal classic, and I should check it out. And I remember seeing this cover years ago, and I just, I don't know, for whatever reason, never got around to actually listening to it. But I uh, saw that they had the reissues in because Headsplit um, is putting out the reissues of this. So I thought, you know what, what the hell, I'm picking it up and checking it out. That's Savage Grace with Master of the Skies. And uh, as I said, I recognized that cover anywhere as soon as I saw it advertised. Uh, this is freaking awesome. Comes on a nice uh, red tape. But, uh, yeah, I listened to this yesterday while I was doing a little bit of cleaning, and oh my god, this is so good. Um, love, whoops, <laughs> love the vocals, um, and I gotta say that a lot of the riffing on here, of course, you know, it is speed metal, but it has that kind of, you know, new wave of British heavy metal vibe, and even some, I get a, lot, a little bit of a Maiden influence to some of the riffing, but really solid stuff, definitely happy I picked that up. Uh, next up is kind of a blind buy you know whenever i go on head split i always look at what the new arrivals are and then i check out the samples that they uh, provide and i really like what i heard off of this one but this is a uh, cosmic putrefaction the horizons towards which splendor withers uh yeah really killer sounding death metal haven't listened to the whole thing but uh the samples i said like that i listened to sounded really good so I had to pick that one up. And this is another one that I missed out on before. They've had this a couple times now already. And I kept missing out on it. Finally got a copy of it because I've been told by several people now that I need to hear this. This is Infester with To the Depths in Degradation. I uh, love that cover. And it comes on a nice red tape. And uh, honestly, I have not heard a single note that this band has ever played. Uh, I just know that people have told me I needed to check it out. And I kept missing it every time Head Split had it. And this time around, I saw it was in stock. And I just immediately added it to the cart. So, looking forward to checking that out. And last but not least, the tape that I have been waiting for and waiting for to get in stock. I mean, it's been available overseas, but I really didn't want to pay overseas pricing for shipping and having to wait, never knowing, because lately a lot of packages are getting lost. But, uh, yeah, I reviewed this here recently, and that is the brand new demo from Enigmatum, Adorned in Wrath. Absolutely killer demo. Definitely going to be on my uh, year-end list. It's the spine. Uh, as I said, Head Split put out the North American release, and I loved the shell of this. It's a nice dark blue, which really fits with the album cover. But yeah, really solid mix of black and death metal. Um, the drum production on this is just so heavy. But uh, yeah, 
definitely check this one out for sure. If you don't check anything else out that I have shown, definitely check this one out. Um, I'm really looking forward to their new album next year. So, yeah, that is going to do it. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. And until next time, stay brutal.